Hello and welcome to another Firefly Studios video. Today we're going to be sending out a love letter to Stronghold fans and castle builders everywhere by running through our top Stronghold secrets and Easter eggs. From film references to spooky ghosts, we'll be taking you through all the secrets hidden away in the dark recesses of the Stronghold game code. But don't worry, we're not going to be revealing all of them today. So if you want to be a famous internet celebrity who's found every Stronghold Easter egg, now's your time. Let's get to the list. First up, we've got something that will send shivers down your spine. In the old but gold first installment in the series, Stronghold 1, try placing a shrine or two down and prepare yourselves. Do you see him? There he is, your very own castle ghost. But don't worry, no ghost busting needed as the ghost will just chill out, wish you could savour the taste of apples from your granary and generally have a decent time doing what any ghost would do, spooking about and scaring folk. Ever wondered what Stronghold Legends would look like in third person? Well, put that noggin to other uses, because with a few taps of the keyboard, you can do this right now. Just look at the action, the intensity. Oh boy, this fight isn't fair. This green dude isn't going to survive. Oh yep, he's dead. Huh. This is actually kind of relaxing. Sweet Jesus, look at that dragon. Seeing it up close, I kind of feel bad for sending my troops into these battles. Yeah, this guy's got the right idea. Walk away from the battle. Next up, we've got a little treat that might be known to those who've tried entering something fantastical as their Lord name. Perhaps the name of a well-known Sith Lord? Greetings, Lord Vader. Obi-Wan has taught you well, but you are not a Jedi yet. <laughs> But Lord Vader is just one of the edgy phrases and shorthands that our dear narrator treats us with. Let's have a listen. Greetings, the Flying Poo! Not long till morning now, sire. You're going to need your beauty sleep. Please eat, my liege. I fear you are wasting away. You can't tell me what to do. You're not even my real dad. <laughs> now for a slightly more obscure reference for some of our international players. Ever heard of Monty Python? If not, here's a little taste. This is your last chance. I've been more than reasonable. Fetchy la vache. Quoi? Fetchy la vache. For those of you with a good ear for insulting French accents, that's legendary actor John Cleese saying Fetchy la vache. The same phrase used for one of our Crusader 2 achievements in which you kill an enemy lord with a diseased cow. Fetchy la vache. Quoi? Fetchy la vache. Jesus Christ! Crikey! <laughs> Onto our beloved intergalactic world of science fiction, Space Conley gets a tad political with a theme mission based on the whole Trump versus Forbes debacle. In case you've forgotten, back in the late 2000s, now President Donald Trump, wanted to build a massive golf complex in Aberdeenshire. One Scottish farmer, Michael Forbes, refused to sell his land to Trump so he could build over it, and now Forbes is regarded as a local hero. So logically, you introduce lasers, aliens, and space stations into the mix, and you've got our Easter egg. For all you film fanatics out there, recognize this clip? No? Shame on you. Well, here it is anyway in a certain British cult hit. Who doesn't love a bit of Ewan McGregor? Well, apart from that one trilogy he did. My allegiance is to the Republic, to democracy! Are you a stronghold player with an eagle eye? then you might have come across a certain phrase to live by in our games. Here's a clip highlighting our holy scripture. Nice. So those were our favorite Stronghold and Space Colony Easter eggs, but if you've got a favorite pop culture reference we didn't mention in the video, put it in the comments below and we might include it in a future video. If you like the video, make sure you give us a like and subscribe here on Firefly Worlds for new Stronghold content every Thursday at 3 p.m. Bye.